had a request to do a, a Hawaii beach surfer type scene, surfer in silhouette. So I thought I'd give one a bash today. Not quite sure how it's going to turn out, but there's only one way to find out. So I'm going to give it clean water with a large hike and then just uh, throw a load of colour at it basically. Sort of predominantly red. Bit of red, bit of yellow, and then a bit of blue. And clean the brush, getting a bit, uh, bit muddy now. So, sort of red and blue. Maybe a bit of Payne's grey thrown in there as well. Really sort of darkening up a bit. And then in that middle area, a bit more yellow. So that's a sort of nice little background. To work with, and then what I'm going to do, I'm going to give that a quick dry. Now what I want, I want the, uh, there's not going to be any land as such, just the sort of foreground shore, so, but I want the uh, the horizon line, because it's the sea, I want it to look dead level, you know what I mean? Normally I sort of, it's hit and miss, but this one, I'm just going to pull it tight, the paper stretched slightly, and then refix it, and then what I'm going to do is uh, use some masking tape. Work out where my horizon line is going to be. So, where shall I go? Something like. Hang on, I think we're. So, I want to have the surface somewhere. I want the head about. Maybe just popping up over the horizon. See if I just stick it about there, I think. Something like that. And then take that down. I'm bothered about the bottom, but I want that. Make sure that's because I don't want the paint getting behind that. Um, hang on, I've done this the wrong way around, and it's the other way. Doesn't matter. It's that bit. That's going to be the horizon line. The bottom of the tape, not the top. What a prep. That doesn't matter. Uh, yeah, I'll leave it. I'll, I'll should, no, I'm not. Yeah, that shouldn't have happened. I was a bit hasty. That should be. Don't know. I can paint over that because that's going to be the uh, the horizon line. I'm going to make it a bit darker. So with that in place, I'm now going to just dip the tips of the uh, hike in just to uh, bring the uh, hairs together. And then that's see. Uh, I just want it to be dark at the top. So I'm going to go light red, um, ultramarine, and then just sort of, I want this to be fairly dark and 
know, something like that. I mean, maybe we can have a sort of yellowy bit sort of coming around like that actually no. I might use this one for a change use the flap switching to the flap and there's a sort of lighter area Just do it like that. Something like that. And then a bit more, it's sort of darker on the other side. And a bit of pain's grain so it really darken it up. Light red, ultramarine, Payne's grey. I just want to get that a bit darker on that side. some of these over. Oh, I'm going to give that another quick dry. Carefully this time, I'm gonna pull this, and we should be left with a nice level horizon line on the sea. Something like that. So, with that in place, I'm then gonna switch to the rigger and then just pop our surfer in. So again, back into, I want it really dark now, so it's going to be sort of silhouetted. So light red, um, ultramarine, bit of Payne's grey, nice and dark. 
I mean, if we sort of have, I'm trying to think where to, best place to put in. Sticky bay, I think. So there's his head. And then he's sort of. The sort of top of his body. And then there's like a big. Big surfboard. Some wire. Then down the bottom we've got their legs. Some of it just doesn't quite look right to me. Well, if I do that a bit bigger and put the head up there like that. And then there's a sort of shadow going off some of that. I think I'll stop at that now before I go any uh, before I ruin it anymore. It's got them up there. A couple of seagulls I think. Got my signature down there, and I think I'll call that one. Done. Can't resist fiddling with it. Yeah, I think I'll definitely. Something like that anyway, I think you get the general sort of gist of it. That's a little sort of surfer in Hawaii, watching the sun go down. Well, I hope you like that. Thanks for watching, keep practicing and I'll see you again soon.